It's Bonnie. Happy Friday. Happy March 1st. Oh my goodness, you guys. The launch of the Kringle Candle Spring line is here. And I have got a review for you of the ice cream sandwiches candle. I know so many of you are interested in this one. If you're just joining me, I am a Kringle Candle Ambassador, which means if you use the code Queen Geeks. You're going to get 15% off. And thank you so much to Kringle for sending me these candles as a preview so that I could review them. Oh my gosh. So many scents for this collection. There's foodie, fruity, fresh, clean, ocean, you know me, I'm the foodie girl. So of course, I'm going to love the Bananas Foster. I reviewed this one. I got to get this in the big one. Um, I love the Bananas Foster. Um, Fiona just did on Instagram a really good take on the um, charred pineapple, which I need to burn because this one to me, I think, is going to be really good. This is the country candle. So there's six country candles and then there's six of the Kringles with um, the matching three wicks. So ice cream sandwiches. I know everyone's been waiting on this one. Um, this is my second burn on this one. And the scent notes are rainbow sprinkles, sea salt, macadamia nuts, ice cream, ruby chocolate, cotton candy. How interesting is that? Vanilla milkshake, Toasted coconut and tonka bean. So there's a lot going on in this candle. And this is not just a vanilla candle. Let me put that out there first. Not vanilla plain. There's coconut in here. I'll have to say I am getting a lot of the toasted coconut. So if you're not a fan of coconut, um, you might want to consider getting the cake pop if you like like vanilla scents more, because that's more of like vanilla frosting and cake. This one has definitely got a note of the coconut in here. Um, I do get a mix of the vanilla chocolate through here. Um, you get the vanilla plus the sweetness of that ruby chocolate. Uh, the nuttiness, there's a little bit of nuttiness in this candle that smells amazing. Um, if I read the scent description from Kringle, it says, ice cream sandwiches indulge in this delightful, whimsical world of ice cream sandwiches where the playful aroma of rainbow sprinkles, macadamia nuts, sweet milkshake, uh, embrace uh, your senses, um, conjuring the nostalgic joy of the beloved treat. So I don't know, like when I was young, we had like the really plain cheap ice cream sandwiches that were just like the chocolate and vanilla. And if you set them out in the sun, they like didn't even melt. <laughs> Where were the cheap ones? <laughs> this is what I would call a super high end ice cream sandwich. This is an ice cream sandwich you're going to get like at a really good ice cream shop. Um, because there's a lot going on. Look how pretty it is. Like there's there's ice cream, uh, there's sprinkles, there's chocolate, there's all kinds of stuff going on in here. And the fact that they put macadamia nuts in it, you know that's like a higher end ice cream sandwich because those are going to cost more. So just know um, there's a lot of good gourmand foodie scents rolling around in here. It smells delicious. The coconut, the vanilla, the chocolate, the sprinkles, they're all mixing up together and they are throwing very well. Um, I want to call this about a nine on my scale. It's not going way up to the 10, uh, but it's a super solid scent. I had this in the living room. I had this in the dining room. I had it in the kitchen. And my whole house is smelling uh, like a gourmand chocolate vanilla coconut macadamia store. Like there's everything. It's kind of like what you would smell if you walked into the ice cream store and you're getting a lot of the scents from the different like um, flavors. Because there's a lot going on in here. There's a lot of scents, including cotton candy, by the way, which gives it a little bit of a sweetness. So if you're liking those gourmand scents, I would definitely consider ice cream sandwiches, bananas foster, which is why I just love this one. This one's like a favorite of mine. 
Um, the strawberry lemonade is going to be more of a fruity one. The charred pineapple is going to have more of that fruity scent. Um, I also wanted to point out that these also come in the wax melts. The wax melts and did I see a daylight on here? Hold on, hold on. Leap into spring. Um, hold on, let me just click on here really good. Yes, they have the daylights. I'm, I'm so glad they have the daylights because if you're kind of on the fence about something, you could always get the sample daylight to see if you like it. Um, so Bananas Foster. Oh, the other one, if you're a foodie person, obviously, which I mentioned earlier, uh, is the Cake Pop, which is that vanilla cakey frosting scent. Um, so again, something for everyone. There's coral, cotton flowers, which has the mint, um, eucalyptus, cotton, gardenia, which I actually kind of like gardenia. That's a nice floral. Um, the ice cream sandwiches, obviously. Uh, lemon tea and roses. I gotta try that one out. I don't know if I'm gonna love that one. There's a little too much rose in there right now. Uh, sage and Palo Santo, which I love. Sand and Sandal is a little bit suntanny, but there's something about it I kind of like. I don't know. That one I'm kind of on the fence about. And then, of course, the strawberry lemonade, uh, which I absolutely love. So anyway, launch day today. Check them out. Daylights, wax melts. Um, if you got the ice cream sandwiches, let me know. I'm curious to see what everyone thinks. And um, I will see you guys later. Don't forget to use the code QueenGeeks uh, for 15% off. Bye-bye.